guys, I did not turn the heat on yet. So, what I'm doing is mounting the light, the second light. And I drilled my holes and marked things already while I had cam the camera on charge a little bit. It's still on charge via Charles's uh, power pack that he donated. So, that's good to have, man, because if I didn't have it, I'd have to keep plugging stuff in and charging, and it's just a mess. So, just carefully feeding up two wires right now for the light. And one thing I also forgot is... Um, Whoops. Uh-oh. I gotta pull this back out. The positive made it up. But the, uh... They didn't kind of... One went under the survival blanket material. And one was above... Was properly going above the survival blanket material, so... I gotta kind of... See what I can get done. Okay, there we go. Now they're both above. There we go. Perfect. Okay, so what I need to do is I need to find more little tiny screws from uh, the dollar store. Now, I don't know where exactly I got those hooks from. It was either Dollarama or Dollar Tree, but I definitely need to do a Dollarama run. I need to go to the bank still, too. Um, I got to pay my dad back because he actually, I didn't have any money on me at the time to pay rent here, but he had the cash, so I got to go to the bank, get him money for that and all, all that stuff. So, but I think I got it. Yeah, I got lined up okay. I'll show you the screws I need, guys. These are really tiny screws that, believe it or not, when I bought this um, container full of hooks and hinges and little screws and stuff, um, I didn't think I'd be going to use it as much as I did. And, uh, yeah, so I'll show you the size screw that I have one left so I can mount one end of that light right now. And the rest is all like uh, hooks and stuff for different things. This is uh, this is how small the screw is. It's a Phillips, and it's probably a half an inch long screw. But this this these worked well because that's what I mounted um, that first light up there with. So I can at least mount this and then start working on the electrical because I do not have um, enough hardware to do much else, guys. So I'll zoom in for you, take a sip, take another hit of this uh, soda, and then I'll... Uh, and now I don't have to pre-drill with these little screws because um, I, I actually did kind of showed that when I first did the other install there, uh, the first light, but they kind of just press in and they work themselves up into the plywood no problem. And uh, yeah, pretty happy with these type of screws. And they're the perfect size for what I'm doing up here with these. So hard to believe those little gimmicky things sometimes really pay off. I've used quite a bit of the gear out of that thing for different things and uh, you know you never think you will now what I do next is I pull up the tension off those wires so they're like just like that so they're a little more straight and then I just got to get one more well, I was, I'm gonna try to get as many of these little screws as I can because that's gonna work out quite nice 
so I'll show you, I'll bring you up here. Actually, no, I can't. But I can turn you this way. So the wires are kind of nice and straight up and down into the ceiling now. I can adjust this so it's kind of straight on. And that's perfect. And I have it facing the right direction. I have the black switch, um, that one and this one facing this direction. So kind of match that way. Now what I need to do is I need to add on, here is, here is my little connector so I don't have to solder the wires together. So I need to attach this up top on the wires. And while I can still reach them, that is. So. <laughs> and I move, the light is pretty much center, but uh, it's still pretty hard to reach. I actually should move the ladder back so I can get my arm up there better. Because that allows me to, not, a, not as bad an angle as I had it. And I should bring a flashlight up here also from Charles to help. Because it is rather dark up here. Oops. There we go. Eventually, I may have to put a lighting system up here, guys, for um, if need be, but, you know, hard to say. Sorry I can't bring you up here, but camera's on charge, so. But you've seen me do it before. I gotta kind of push down on the solder free connector and get the wire in. But it's being an awful pain right now. But anyway, I'll get it. So I'll let the camera charge a bit more, and then I'll bring you back over to my wiring in the storage room there, guys. And uh, we'll go from there. <laughs> 